Hey Polish peeps, welcome to my channel, welcome to my car. Y'all, it's been a minute, right? Like, a hot minute, because <laughs> I had so many things going on. Um, as many of you probably know, I got married last month. Um, so I'm just now trying to get back in the swing of things, hopefully starting to post videos again, blah, blah, blah. Um, so, yeah, it's a whole thing. But um, I wanted to take this opportunity because... It's the only opportunity I've had today <laughs> to um, come on here, talk about polish pickup for September, um, give y'all my wish list, do all the things. Um, I've missed y'all. Like, I've really missed filming. Um, so I'm ready to get back into it. I'm ready to start talking about polish. Y'all, it is hot in my car right now. I may roll down my window just a little bit. Hold, please. <laughs> Okay, hopefully it's not too noisy for you guys. I have a little bit of a breeze coming through. Not much, but just a little bit because it's it's warm. Um, I want to give y'all my wish list, y'all. It's long. It's large and in charge. <laughs> so I'm going to try to do this very quickly. Um, if you guys are not familiar with Polish Pickup and how it works, um, I will have all of that information down in the description box for you guys. I'm not going to go into it in the video. Well, okay, I'll go into it a little bit. So it is a monthly collaboration of indie polish makers um, that make a polish based on a common theme. Um, oh gosh, y'all, I don't even know what the theme is this month. <laughs> I got to get with the program, like for real. Um, I'll put the theme for this month up on the screen for you guys. Screen, it's not a screen, but anyway. You guys get it. Um, and it goes live the first Friday of every month and runs through Monday. So it goes live at 10 a.m. Central Friday, runs through Monday midnight, I believe. Um, I'll give you all of the additional information down below. Uh, wish listing is open now, open now. So you guys, it generally opens the Sunday before Polish Pickup opens. Um, so you guys can go on there now and get your wish list together. I like to come on here if you're new to my channel um, and give you guys my wish list, give you guys my thoughts on things that you may want to pick up um, just based on what I've purchased. Um, maybe, maybe not help you make some decisions about what you might want to buy. I don't know, but hopefully this uh, video can kind of give you a little bit of input about makers and uh, what my experience is with them as far as the polishes that they make. Um, if you guys don't know, I have a very large polish collection. Um, I have bought from a lot of the makers that um, are on Polish Pickup. So I just like to give you guys my input. Um, so if you're interested in that, hopefully stick around and um, let's talk about some polish. Okay, so I believe I have 18 on here, 18 polishes, but I also have some non-polish items. I didn't mention before, but Polish Pickup does have other things. Jewelry, um, nail art supplies, um, lotions, top coats, base coats, just a wide variety of other things that you can purchase as well. Um, so I do have some of those items on here. Normally I go polish first and then other items, but I think today I'm going to go other items first because I think that'll go a little faster. I really only have 30 minutes, so I'm going to try and squeeze this into 30 minutes. Um, so there is a quick drying, um, spray that I love. It dries my polishes like instantly. I'm so happy to see it on polish pickup. I don't no, it might have been on Polish Pickup before and I might have missed it, but I normally um, purchase the spray from another collab. I think it's, is it Smidgen of Us? I can't remember. It's another collab that I've seen it on and I bought a couple and um, I'm excited to see it on Polish Pickup because I will probably stock up because I love it so much. It's the Express Drying Spray by Baroness X. It's $6.75. Um, let's see, is there a cap on it? There is no cap on here that I can tell, but it's just a spray that you spray on your polish after you do your nails, y'all. I mean, it, it dries my polish like, I mean, quick drying top, top coat dries your polish quick, but this like, I mean, it's instant. I love it so, so much. It's like perfect when you're on the go. I'm always on the go when I do my manis. Um, 
I polish my nails every day, which by the way, I don't look at my mani right now because it's a hot mess. But anyway, <laughs> I polish my nails every day. I'm usually trying to do a quick, you know, mani. Um, so this is perfect for when I need to just spray and go and be out the door. Usually I'll spray by the time I get to whatever it is that I'm having to do to get ready to go, they're dry. So I love this stuff. It's $6.75. If you guys are looking for a quick drying spray, this one is an option. Um, there's also some cute pumpkin earrings that I have on my wish list that I really want. I have bought earrings from this brand before. I don't even know how to say it. It's Z-R-A. Is that Zra? <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, cute pumpkin earrings, $9. Look how cute those are. Oh my gosh, I love them so much. I'm kind of obsessed right now with Halloween. Um, this is typically the time of year when I start kind of like getting my Halloween polishes, getting my Halloween like you know earrings and t-shirts and stuff like that um so yes these are nine dollars there's only a hundred of these available so i have a feeling y'all train <sighs> anyway sorry about the train so i have a feeling these are gonna go quick because they're so cute um i ordered some ooh, what did i order some other earrings they were like I think they were like cute polish bottles those are so cute um, if I can remember no I'm not even gonna say that I I never remember to stick pictures in here when I say I'm going to so I'm not gonna say that anyway check out these earrings those are super cute nine dollars um, and they're capped at a hundred so if you don't know what cap means that means that they've basically made a hundred pairs of earrings or 100 bottles of polish and once they're gone they're gone so you guys want to snag those quick if there is a cap there's also a top coat by night owl lacquer it is black light reflective i think glows in the dark um uv reactive quick dry top coat y'all i can turn any polish that i have i have nothing like this i can turn any polish that i want to into a glow in the dark polish like what 750 by night owl lacquer there's only one picture, but look how cool that is. Not that I'm really all about having my polishes glow in the dark, but it's kind of cool, right? Like if you have something that you want to um, have glow in the dark polish for and you don't have a glow in the dark polish for it, you can just put this top coat on and then bam, you have a glow in the dark polish. Um, top coat by Cuticula. It is a um, smoothing coat quenched, which is for... Thirsty polishes, textured polishes, um, glitter bombs to smooth them out. Super distracted right now, squirrel. Anyway, to smooth them out, I have a couple of um, top coats similar to this, but I have not tried the one by Cuticula, so kind of interested in trying that one out. Here's some pictures, which I mean, it looks like it works pretty good. Like, look how textured that is, and then it smooths it out to this. That's that's pretty amazing, right? Um, I feel like I typically don't always remember to use these top coats that smooth out these texture polishes, but I mean, it does such a good job. I should definitely use it more. This one's priced at $8, so if you're interested in that, you might want to check that out as well. Um, and then there is a, let's see, one more thing. There's a Cinnamon Matte Coat from... Our scented matte top coat from Anchor and Heart Lacquer is priced at $7.50 and it's scented. Y'all, I don't have a scented matte top coat. I know a lot of people do not like their polishes scented, but I really like my polishes scented. Like, like I, I get kind of obsessed with like, you know, having my hands move past my face and smelling something delicious or, you know, florally or whatever. I don't know, I'm one of those girls that is definitely like soothed by aromatherapy. So yeah, I might pick this one up. Um, inspired by Midnight Pomegranate. It is a mysteriously juicy scent featured pomegranate, orange, vanilla, and a warm touch of cinnamon. Doesn't that sound amazing? I might pick that one up just because it's something I don't have. So if you're interested in a um, amazing smelling matte top coat you might want to pick that up I don't use matte top coats that often so um, when I do to have one that's in mm. 
That's going to be fabulous. Okay, let's get to the polishes. I think I have 18, something like that. Oh, wait, one more item. KB Shimmers Sugar Scrubs. Y'all, if you've not tried them, you've got to try them. I have several of them, like, around my house. I use them all the time. I, um, well, I won't say all the time. I definitely use them when I think of it. <laughs> But my children use them as well, and so they tend to get stolen from my room, but they are amazing. This one is um, grape scented. Grape scented is just happens to be one of my favorite scents, I guess. Also flavors, like in candy and different things like that. So um, it's priced at $10. Y'all, if you haven't tried, let me just say, if you haven't tried one of KB Shimmer's Sugar Scrubs, just, just pick one up. It doesn't have to be this one. Um... You know, if you don't care for grape scent, then try another scent. They're just amazing. And they make your hands all soft and smooth. And it's just a good practice to kind of do a sugar scrub on your hands once or twice a week. Um, you know, get around your cuticles and everything. So definitely recommend um, KB Shimmers uh, sugar scrubs if you have not picked them up. $10 for that. Um, let's talk about the polishes. I tried to pick polishes that... Um, they reminded me of Halloween, but there weren't too many of those that I were like, I was like, oh yeah, this is Halloween polish. Um, so then I was like, I'm just going to pick what I like. <laughs> and that's typically how it goes anyway. So this one is all mixed up lacquers. Typically I swatch for them, but I didn't swatch this one. Um, and I think this is super cute y'all for nail art and like um stamping or nail stickers on top uh water decals on top for i mean you could do it for halloween i think i saw um well here's one i'm not is this i think these are supposed to be skulls but you can't really tell but there's some stickers on that one um but i think this would be really cute with nail art price at 12.50 um, a scattered holographic gray base with holographic flakes, white and black hex glitters, multiple colors of micro holographic glitters, and bits of iridescent flakes and hex glitters. Available, there's 150 of these available and they're priced at $12.50. I know I'm going kind of quickly, but these are, you can read all of these on the website. Um, I will just tell you, All Mixed Up Blacker does these, um, it's not really glitter bomb, but like, Crelly bases so good like okay here's a better picture like look at that combination of flakiness <laughs> and goodness underneath and the formula is so good y'all definitely want to look into this one if you have not picked up one of these from all mixed up lacquers Baroness X is also doing um a fluid nail art um polish and I have picked up a couple of these I haven't had the time to work on my fluid nail art skills, but I really want to do a fluid nail art mani. Um, I keep saying that to myself and then I just don't. I swatch so much now, y'all. I don't have time to do nail art manis for myself, but I definitely want to set some time um, aside to do one for Halloween because look how cool that looks, y'all. That looks so cool. I'm obsessed with the way that this looks on the nails. Um, it's priced at $12.50. It is um, called Spector. Did I give y'all the name of the last one? I don't think I did. Hmm, I'll put it on, this, on the... <laughs> when I edit, I'll put it up for y'all. But this is a blue, purple, magenta, brass, multi-chrome fluid art polish with hollow effect. Um, I have done fluid nail art one time. And it was kind of before fluid nail art polishes became a thing. Like I made my own fluid nail art polish with that serum that you get in the store. What is it called? I can't think of the name of the serum right now, but you can make your own um, fluid nail art polishes with it. And I made my own and I, that's how I did my fluid nail art. Well, that was before fluid nail art polishes were like coming out and being a thing. So I have a couple at home. I definitely may pick this one up just because it would be unique to my collection and I'm gonna try it. It looks cool. So that's $12.50 and there's 190 of those available. Um, Bluebird Lacquer is another super amazing brand. Lucy is so sweet. 
um, the maker of Bluebird, not the maker, yeah, the maker of Bluebird, <laughs> Bluebird, lac Bluebird Lacquer. Um, this is the Walking Debt. I'm going to try to remember to give y'all names from here on out. <laughs> inspired, it's inspired by the scariest thing I can think of, which is student debt. Oh my God, y'all, don't even get me started. Um, the Walking Debt is a uh, spooky shifts of lime blue and purple with black flakies and a ghost of black reflective glitter. Give this an ethereal haunted vibe. So it doesn't look like there's a cap on this one. Look how pretty that is. The only thing that might give me cause, not cause, but pause on this one is because it is green. Typically your girl does not go for, well, okay, I won't say I don't go, go for green polishes because I have green polishes in my collection, but it's not like one of those things where I'm just like, yes. Um, but y'all, this looks so amazing on the nails. Look at that. I am very drawn to this. Very drawn to it. I think it's the Shimmer. Um, is it the Shimmer? I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the blue and purple shift. Maybe that's it. It's something about it. I don't know. I don't know what it is. But <laughs> this 1250, you guys might want to check out that one from Luber Lacquer. Cuticula, Never Sleep Again. This is one of the ones that I was like, oh yeah. That's definitely Halloween. This is priced at $13. Um, it's inspired by Freddy Krueger, if that gives you any idea of what the polish looks like. It's a blood red base with large particle red, gold, green, shifting shimmer, matte, black flakes, and small silver holographic flakes. Y'all, I am all about anything that looks like blood on your nails for Halloween. <laughs> this one fits that description, like, perfectly. Um, it's priced at $13. Does not appear to be a cap, but y'all look at this. That is like Halloween on the nails. Like, I just love the black flakes in there. Um, oh y'all, look at this one matte. That looks amazing matte. I could just imagine this one matte with my scented matte top coat on top. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all. This is so pretty. I definitely... I definitely, definitely feel like I want to pick this one. These swatches are giving me life. Like, I definitely feel like I want to pick this one up. Y'all, I don't need any polish. Let's just make that clear right now. I need zero polishes right now to add to my collection. Zero. But I have no self-control. Zero self-control. DRK Nails. I'm in love with a monster. Priced at $13. The other thing I've kind of been wanting, not really wanting, but like wanting to wear more of is magnetic polishes they do take a little bit more time which is why i have not worn any but <laughs> well i won't say i haven't worn any i just don't wear them that often this one is purple it's inspired by hotel transylvania 2 music same from fifth harmony music group y'all i love that movie it's a green magnetic mix with colored flaky, colored flakes, reflective glitter, some blue and violet base. Um, there's no cap on it right now. Sometimes that changes before the actual um, sale is live. But look at this pretty magnetic pull on this. It's, I love this base, y'all. I am in love with this base. Some of the pictures are a little lighter. Um, and I feel like I would be happy if the base was like super dark with that um what color is that line mm, it says green it doesn't really look mm, okay it looks green in the pictures a little bit but look at that line y'all look at that base so pretty um i'm definitely drawn to this one because the base is purple of course you guys know that if you've watched me for a while, you know that about me. If you haven't been watching that for a while, y'all, purple is my jam. I really dig some purple. So, hmm, I'm definitely drawn to this. I don't have a lot of DRK polishes. I have purchased from this brand before on Polish Pickup before, but I don't think I have worn a lot of them. Um, so, yeah. I love that one so pretty price of $13 ethereal lacquer y'all this blue is gorgeous I, I don't even know it's like other it's like otherworldly on the nails I don't even know how to describe it no you hang up first is the name of the polish $13 
um, on here now. There's no cap. It's inspired by Scream. It's a deepened warble base that leans more blue with a haunting blue to violet shimmer and holographic flakes. I think it is because the base is maybe is blurple and not blue, but even if it was blue, I don't care, y'all. This is stunning. Look how that blue, oh gosh, it just shines so bright. It's definitely an attention grabber. Like, if you're wanting attention to your nails, this is going to do it for you. You're definitely going to get the attention. People are going to be, like, seeing your nails from, like, way across the room. <laughs> and they're going to be like, what is that? Ooh, let me go see what's on that girl's nails. So if you want that type of attention, definitely pick this one up. Ethereal is a fabulous brand, y'all. <sighs> beautiful, beautiful polishes. Amazing formula. $13. Um, I actually usually can't resist ethereal when they're in a collab I just I always have to pick them up Dior Couture beautifully spooky this is um, calling me because it glows in the dark <laughs> it's priced at $12 I do swatch for Dior Couture but I did not swatch for her this month um, but it is a inspired by spooky night sky um, it is if I did I tell y'all the name? I don't know. Beautifully spooky. Magenta pink when it's warm to violet when it's cold. Thermal with gold shimmer and two different tones of orange, black, and light reflective glitter. Um, she does amazing thermal jaw. And this thermal is right up my alley. Like, the shift is so pretty. Um, and it's giving me Halloween vibes. Check out this swatch of it, y'all. That is so, so pretty. I love the way it looks not all glowing and glowing in the dark and um it's purple so yeah and it transitions it's thermal to i mean it's like with a gold shimmer like what i love everything about this polish it's giving me everything i could hope for in a polish so i definitely am thinking about picking this one up as well Look how amazing that looks, glowing in the dark. I love it so much. Beautifully Spooky by Dior, Dior Couture for $12. And currently, no cap on that one. I also have Kathleen & Co. I also swatch for this brand. Amazing formula, y'all. I'm, I'm not just trying to, like, <laughs> get y'all to buy the polish. I'm just speaking the truth because it is. And... This is another purple polish, so you guys know I'm all about it. The Graveyard Shift. Um, it's priced at $13. I'm going to start my car and turn on some air because there's a band playing across the street. And I don't want that in my video. Um, the Graveyard Shift is a deep purple base with vampy, gold, vampy red gold shimmer with a ghostly blue mag magnetic pull that shifts to purple to pink. This polish can be worn both ways. It's like you literally have two different polishes because it looks amazing uh, magnetized and it looks amazing non-magnetized. It just, I mean, I don't care. <laughs> Y'all, look how amazing that looks. And like I said, I am seriously drawn to magnetic polishes right now and it's just so pretty. <gasps> look. That magnetic line is giving me life. I love it. So pretty. Um, so if you love purple like me and you're, you know, wanting to try a really nice, smooth magnetic polish, you might want to pick this one up. Again, that's Kathleen and Co. Price at thirteen dollars. Um, let's see. Next, I have KB Shimmer. Um, there's a lot of purples on my <laughs> there's a lot of purples or purplish polishes on my list this month so um you guys know I try to resist to get a little variety in what I buy um so that will act definitely help me make my decision but this is KB Shimmer it scares me um inspired by it priced at $12 um Let's see, what does it say? Mimicking that colorful clown suit of the minis, miniseries. That's one word. 
It Scares Me nail polish features a cool tone grape like purple base loaded with micro color shifting flakes. Um, this polish takes on a rainbow of hues echoing the red hair along the green and yellow of the clown suit. Mm, I am not a big fan of the movie, but this polish is gorgeous. <laughs> KB Shimmer, amazing formula. Um, I've never been disappointed by KB Shimmer. It's dark and deep and vampy and shifty. I mean, what else can you say? There's really not much else you can say. It just looks so, so, so pretty. And I am, this is my friend Josephine's swatch. I could recognize her swatches anywhere. Um, it's just, it's everything. It's perfect for fall you know perfect for Halloween like that's the vibe it gives so um, you might want to pick this one up as well KB Shimmer $12 there's no cap on there and usually I want to say KB Shimmer doesn't typically have a cap usually not Lemming Lacquer this is another brand that I have not purchased a whole lot from but it's magnetic so I'm like and it's like giving me fall vibes and there's also a little bit of like purpley color in there so this is called afraid of the dark price at $13 um, it is a dark plum red base with gold copper magenta magnetic pool and holographic micro flakes I guess it's the plum that's the grapey <laughs> grapey part or like the purple for me um, but y'all look at this um, magnetized and I know y'all are looking at me like, where's the purple? <laughs> Hold up, wait, let me show you. <laughs> okay, look, look, there's the purple right there. It's a teeny tiny little purple spot in the bottom. <laughs> it's all I need, it's all I need, y'all. It's so pretty. I really like this shade. Like, I don't know, it's just pulling me. It's, it's giving me fall vibes, which I think is also something that I'm looking for in polishes this month, as well as Halloween vibes, so definitely thinking about picking this one up also because I like to purchase from brands that I don't typically purchase from and this is one of them so $13 just to like give other makers a shot you know and see what I think um, there's 200 bottles of this one available uh, moving on I have MJ lacquer the birds another fabulous brand y'all you gonna I say fabulous brand for all of them because they just are um, but I can speak from experience because I have swatched for this maker before. So I can give y'all my honest opinion um, about the maker and what I think of the polishes. So this is inspired by Alfred Hitchcock's classical movie, The Birds. It's a light gray Crelly with violet, pink, gold UCC flakes, black and iridescent flakes, purple to red Aurora shimmer. There's 170 of these available. And let me show y'all the swatch that got me. It's this one. <laughs> what? Y'all. Oh my gosh. I love this flaky combination. It's so pretty. So, so, so pretty. Um, I just really love the way this looks on the nails. I feel like I may have something definitely not similar, but maybe similar enough for me to be like, okay, Ebony, you need to skip this time. But I do really, really love the way this looks. Um, and if you haven't tried MJ Lacquer polishes before, you might want to take this opportunity because they are fabulous. And this flaky combination in here looks so good. So again, price at $12 with 170 available of that one. Next I have, oh gosh y'all, we have so many left. Okay, we're going to try to go through this quick. Nailed it polish. Um, Hail to the King. This just looks, y'all, it's purple, red, blue. <laughs> $13. Um, a smoky purple base with blue to purple, UCC flakies, red to gold, UCC flakies, red to gold, crystal flakies, all the flakies. Give me all the flakies. Um, there's 350 bottles of this available. Nailed it. They nail it. <laughs> when it comes to this, um, particular I guess um, type of finish on a polish they do this so well y'all I mean they're just like master like 
it is just they have mastered this formula and finish for polishes um, so if you haven't tried a nail dip polish with a flaky goodness um, you might want to pick this one up I'm just saying you might want to just go ahead and do it $13 350 of those available noodles nail polish is another brand that I have not purchased from in a hot minute but I really do like her curlies um, another maker that does curlies really well it's freaking bats also I also like the name it's freaking bats <laughs> price at 1150 a purple curly it leans more jellyish with matte to hollow black glitters orange iridescent glitters and hollow orange glitters dries texture due to glitters but I mean I throw on a glitter smoothing top coat and go on with your life because it's so pretty it's definitely worth it look at that I love that it leans more jelly because you can just see those glitters um, in that jelly base and I really love the way that looks on the nails plus the name is just amazing it looks really good matted up too look at that glitter combination in there perfect for Halloween perfect for fall perfect for all the upcoming things y'all just mm, perfect um, Noodles Nail Polish is freaking bats, 1150. There's no cap listed on here currently, so check that out as well. Polish Polish. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. I always feel like I'm saying it wrong, but this is Welcome Great Pumpkin. I don't really feel like this is pumpkin colored, mm, but that's also a reason why I'm drawn to it because I don't think I have anything quite like this color in my collection. I say that a lot and it's not the truth. <laughs> it's just my excuse for buying more polish, but any excuse is not a good excuse because I already have too much polish, but $14 for this one. It is a peachy orange packed with holographic flakes and bright red shimmer. It's probably the peach that's kind of throwing it off for me as far as like a pumpkin colored polish, but I mean, it doesn't matter. It's polish polish and I love I love their polishes I love their formulas I say their I, I love her formulas I'm not exactly sure how I'm supposed to say that but this looks like and look in this shot it looks a lot lighter than some of the other shots but look at it here um I don't know and then in this one it looks like a dark orange so I think maybe it's the silver um, or the holographic flakes that are like making it look brighter and it may actually be a darker orange like peachy leaning orange I don't know but either way I'm definitely intrigued $14 there's no cap listed on here and if you have not tried Palish definitely check out that brand I say that a Polish for days. This one is an honorable mention. Towards the light, priced at $13. It is a deep purple base with gold metallic iridescent flakes and black flakes. I'm not going to say a whole lot about this one because I am drawn to it because the base is purple, but I also feel like that there's like a ton of flakies in it and the flakies kind of drown out the base. You guys can comment down below and tell me what you think, but it kind of drowns it out a little bit. I'm not really sure if I'll pick this one up because of that because I would rather it be purple with gold flakies but like with more purple coming through um it's still very very beautiful y'all it's still gorgeous on the nails it's just kind of depends on what you what you're looking for you know to take center stage on your nails and this one it looks like it's going to be the gold flakies taking center stage and I like the purple so, um, I don't know. Kind of up to you. I'm on the fence on this one. I do love Polish for Days polishes. Um, I still may end up picking it up <laughs> just for that reason. I may not be able to pass it up, but we'll see what happens. So, that's $13. No cap listed on that one currently. Um, and I will tell you guys, today is Tuesday. So, a few more days until the site goes live. 
Okay, I think we're down to four, four more polishes. I'm gonna try to finish these. So, Psych Minerals Dim Bones. It's another, hold up. No, it's not a magnetic. It just kind of looked magnetic in that picture. But I think it is a multi-chrome. Dim Bones is an emerald green to blue to purple shifty shift, super shifty multi-chrome. Y'all, the shifts on this, oh, so pretty. I don't think I have any Psych mineral, Minerals polishes, so that's kind of why I put this one on my wish list because I wanted to try the brand. Priced at $12.50, there's 150 of these available, and this formula looks just so smooth and buttery on the nails, and I just love a good multi-chrome. I feel like I definitely, definitely, definitely have something similar to this with the shift, but it is mm, so pretty, y'all, and that formula looks amazing. So I might give Psych Minerals a try just because I have not purchased from them her I never know whether to say, because it's just me assuming that it's a female maker, and it may not be, so, <laughs> anyway, 150 of those available, definitely might try this one, just for funsies, because I like to try different things, um, let's see, what else do I have, Rogue Lacquer, of course, is purple, this is Jack, priced at $13, it's inspired by Jack from Animal Crossing, he appears during the Halloween season. So I play Animal Crossing, but it's kind of like on and off for me because I don't really have time to play it the way I want to. Um, but I get excited when like holidays come around because different things happen with the game than just like, your, you know, typical day. Um, so I'm excited about Halloween because this time last year I was not playing Animal Crossing. And so mm, your girl's going to be on it so I can see Jack. <laughs> Jack is a blue leaning purple with orange to red to glo gold glass flake and hollow flakes. There's 100, 400 bottles of this available. Rogue Lacquer typically has a huge cap. Y'all, I, I love this one so much. I don't know if I can pass this up. Do I have something similar to it? Yes, I probably do. Do I still want it? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Am I probably going to get it? I mean... I would say it's like 90% yes, maybe 10% no. Rogue Lacquer, again, kills it with these flaky formulas. Like, why? <laughs> I don't know if Rachel watches my videos. Somehow I doubt it. But if you're watching, why do you do this to us? <laughs> oh my God, it's so pretty. Definitely highly recommend this one, y'all. So pretty. $13, that's Jack. Um, another brand that does amazing, amazing shimmer on the nails. Um, just shifty goodness. Sassy Sauce Polish. This is Glamp, Glamp, Glam Pyre. Price at $13, y'all. This picture, I'm like, what? Um, it's a violet jelly packed with red, copper, golden, shifting shimmer, black, red, shifting multi-chrome flakes, and red glitter flakies. When it hits the light, it sparkles. There's 300 of these available, and check out these freaking swatches, y'all. I mean, what? Like, seriously. Check out that shimmer. I mean, if you're getting this shimmer, holy crap. If you're getting this shimmer in a picture, like, imagine it in in person in real life like it's gonna be legit in your face like bam in the flakies mm. y'all y'all need to pick this one up <laughs> I can say that about all of them but definitely definitely for the shimmer in this one I feel like the makers each have something that they bring to the table when it comes to things that they're good at as far as making polishes and sassy sauce is good with the shimmer Sassy Sauce is not the only one. There's a lot of brands that are good with shimmer. But this, like, every time I see a Sassy Sauce polish with a shimmer, like, I'm, I'm drawn to it. Like, immediately drawn to it. She's just so good with, like, <laughs> making you want to buy the polish. <laughs> just by that shimmer alone. And then throw some flakies in there, and I'm like, sign me up, add to cart. So, that is Glampire, priced at $13, 300 bottle cap on that I think we are down to the last one and the last one I have is wildflower lacquer you guys already know I love me some wildflower lacquer I feel like I have something like this 
I'm I need to go to my collection and check out see if I have something close to this I actually feel like I have something close to this from wildflower lacquer so I may pass it up but it's purple ghostly good time so I'm telling y'all about it because I highly recommend you don't pass it up I might have to <laughs> but I don't want you guys to miss out because it is freaking <sighs> so pretty $13 there's no cap listed on here um, ghostly good time is a purple jelly base packed with red to gold to green crystal flakes pink to orange to purple crystal flakes and aqua to green to purple crystal flakes y'all crystal flaking me up oh my gosh so pretty I am in love with the way this looks like what mm, it's the purple for me you guys know it's the purple for me but also wildflower lacquer is just one of my favorite brands this year like literally this year wildflower lacquer became one of my favorite brands and i have purchased so much from wildflower lacquer this year it's insane um i never can pass wildflower lacquer up so you guys don't pass wildflower lacquer up like definitely try the brand if you haven't tried the brand go down the rabbit hole with me jump in the water it's fine it's nice and warm and cozy in there and we can all live happily ever ha happily ever after. <laughs> <sighs> Loving us some polish. All right, y'all, we made it through. Not too bad on the time, 38 minutes, not too bad. Um, I hope you guys are getting your wish lists together, but if you're not getting your wish list together, hopefully this kind of helps you get started with that process. I um, hope you guys get all of your polish you know wishes um my mani is a hot mess but because i know you guys are probably going to ask i started on it and didn't finish it i, I was going to do something different with the ring finger that was going to be my accent nail and i didn't get to it but i'll show you guys what's on my fingers um or not what's on my fingers but what's currently on my nails um, it is this gorgeous polish right here by Rogue Lacquer. I swatched this collection for her and oh my god, I feel like she needs to make all the colors in this formula. It is fabulous. I love it so much. I almost don't want to use them because I don't want them to go anywhere. <laughs> but, um, are you seriously kidding me here? Like, like, I feel like I need to message Rachel right now and be like, can you please do some more colors in this formula please like I don't even know if it's possible if you know she can get her hands on the components in this polish but oh my god so pretty I'm only going to show you guys and this one is chipping already because I didn't I used a peel off base coat but are you guys like really so there's four polishes in this collection if you picked it up I mean isn't it fabulous like it's so good those of you who didn't pick it up, if you ever find it in a D stash or if it comes back, like definitely snag them because they are freaking gorgeous. Okay, guys, that's all I have. I don't know why I'm clapping. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys, um, you know, are getting some ideas about what you want for polish pickup. I will also be doing a video on the polishes that I swatched for polish pickup, so look out for that. I think I did six polishes and a ring so I'll definitely be doing a video to review those items for you guys so check that out um, I'm back <laughs> so spread the word you guys I'm gonna be posting videos um, hopefully get back into the swing of things and posting like I was before my wedding my wedding kind of threw me all off but that's what weddings do so um, if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up consider subscribing I would love to have you join us um, look for, or I guess hit the notification bell. See, like, I don't even remember how to do my endings. Hit the notification bell so you can get um, notified when I do post videos. And yeah, that's it. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.